Hello, my besties. This one is called Jetliner. It's from the Steve Miller Band. Let's go get it. When it first started, right, I thought, is it going to be an instrumental? You know, because that groove was just like going on and on and on. And the bass line was like doing havoc. <laughs> the bass was ridiculous. And I'm thinking to myself, okay, if it's an instrumental, I can I can dig this. I can get with this. But um, it got better because it started to sing. And, you know, I like the melody. I like, um, I like, I like the, uh, you know, what he's singing about. Um, it's not it's, it's not something like a new you know uh, I've heard that all before but I, I still like it sounds great um, but the groove is it's the main thing for me in the song it's so groovy you know it's um, you just want to dance you know put a big smile on my face uh, let's get some more I don't know. I, I think um, it just feels like you know the seventies was like um, a great period for like a uh, bass players. You know, it, it's like that was the most creative period for like bass guitarists because every song you hear from that period, the bass is just like a killer. You know, the, 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 it's just kicking. You know, um, I don't know what you think. I think maybe the eighties had a bit as well, but I think the seventies that that was the period for all those bass guitarists because you had to hear a band who haven't got like a great bass guitarist. Another one here now, and it's just, it's a kick-ass, you know, bass player, you know, I, I love it so much. 
um, that ride and the and the riff to the song, another fantastic riff. Uh, you know, I I love it. And um, even though I feel like the song, the song meaning is something that I've, I've heard before. You know, uh, like in rock music, particularly, right? I, I think um, I think there's probably like a deeper interpretation here, right? You know, it's it's a rock star who's living on going on tour, and um, he's living behind all what he loves, and he. Even though he's looking forward to like getting out there, you know, and like making a name for himself, he doesn't want to stay too long away from home from those he loves. So basically, he wants to eat his cake and have it. And um, yeah, but but I'm I'm thinking for the for the uh, ordinary man on the street, it could also represent you know us, you know, like you know, chasing our dreams and hoping that you know you don't have to pay like a too big a price for for the dream that you're chasing, you know. So um, you're hoping. Your dream doesn't take you too far away from um, from your essence, you know, your reality and all that. What you, you know, people who are close to you and all that stuff, or maybe sell your soul. Who knows? Um, so yeah, so I I think that's a bigger picture for it. But uh, great stuff, man. I'm loving it. Let's get some more. Down in the city, big old jet and a funky stuff funky like you know like just groovy stuff man uh, i'm in love with that you know you know they, they always like say success is a double-edged sword you know um it's most of the time you have to like um you know give before you can take and and you end up giving so much more than you take um and and i think that's why that's what makes a difference between those who are very successful and those who are just like okay because i think i don't think there's any successful man out there who's very successful who was not ruthless you have to be, you know, you make sacrifices, you know, uh, heavy ones to get to the very top. And and that's why some people just kind of like say, nah, that's not worth it, man. As long as I can pay my bills, eat three square meals a day, take care of my family, I'm okay. I'm not ready to do all that, you know. So, um, yeah, it's, it's um, to get to the top ain't no joke, man. It's to stay there is even harder, you know. But great stuff. I really enjoy that. Um, I hope you did as well. And if you did, don't forget to give the... Uh, uh, the the uh, video a big like for me so that the YouTube guys you know can also get on their jet airliner and fly to wherever they want to fly to. <laughs> also, if it was your first time here today, welcome on board. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you come back again. Better still, hope you uh, stay with the family by subscribing. And I thank you for that in advance. My name is Harry. Stay cool, stay safe out there wherever you are. But most of all, stay beautiful in your heart and soul. And I'll see you at the next airport. Take care. Bye bye. Oh,